Super, congratulations all of you. It's a big deal. You know, getting to the finale day is a big one, always. So please celebrate your success. We always say that. I do want to see some cameras on. People, you're not doing this to me. So busy parents, if you're on the road, that's all right. But kids, please, we'll anyways get to see you in person and we are very excited about that, right? So what I will do is I'm going to break this quick call in 30 minutes and that's why I sort of circulated the decks earlier that you can go over it at peace. We'll anyways put this recording back on the group. Uh, I'm just going to do the logistics bit and then Afreen ma'am is going to walk you through how to prep, what to prep, what is the next set of events. So the first things first, and this is also for your parents. So if they're in and around, that will be lovely. They can join in. Otherwise, you can please communicate with them because we trust your ability to communicate well, right? Okay, you can see my screen. It's uh, pretty much the same document that I think we circulated on the group. Just give me a second. I'm just opening the PDF. That is correct. Uh, uh, we are looking at conducting this at uh, Manav Rachna. Uh, they have been courteous and kind enough to lend us their facilities for the same. Right. And uh, if I walk you through the first most frequent question that I get is, are you serious? Is it at 8 a.m.? Yes, it is. We've got a very... <laughs> So just keep yourself on mute. <laughs> but I'm just saying we will start strict at 8. When I mean 8 means 8 o'clock, it doesn't mean 8.30. Because it's literally been timed for every 15 minutes. Okay, So 8 to 8.30, we will do the registration. 8.30 onwards, we will do the debater briefing. Please, I don't want to hear my flight is landed at 8 o'clock. Can we reach by 9? Uh, we were just driving through, got caught in a traffic jam. It's already a heavy day. If you see, that's literally till 7 p.m. Uh, we will try to conclude, close it by 6.30 like we did in the qualifiers, try to arrest it by 30 minutes. But we need your support to make this happen at 8. Please plan a day prior. Do not plan on the day of the event. Okay, we've had enough mishaps of the kid is not uh, calm and it's delayed the whole tournament. So Manav Rachna is the school and that's important for you to know because uh, you can now plan for all of you that uh, who are coming from outstation to book your travel, book your places. The other thing that we don't enjoy hearing is, and I really need your support on that, is that can you please let me know the results by 12 o'clock so that you know we can leave early. Uh, we've not won anything, so any which way we won't stay for the award ceremony. I can assure you, and if you've done earlier ideal events, you will know this very well. Nobody walks away empty-handed. Uh, we do want to make sure everybody is recognized, and we make sure that they do. So please feel free to go and see earlier reels, but do not ask me for results prior than when we have planned. It's been planned around 6 p.m. Okay, that's what I'm saying. We need at least an hour. Okay, you guys do such a great job that we want to be able to recognize you. So 6 to 7 is uh, when we want to be able to do the award ceremony. Uh, results, though typically the day will look like semi-finals in the morning half and finals in the second half. I think, uh, Afreen, you declared the finalist for impromptu directly. Yes, which is where the actually the finals of impromptu is probably happening uh, in the first half itself. So, so after you man, I'm going to uh, walk you through all the format clarifications in a minute. I won't take more time. Parents, any questions that you may have, uh, you have the ugly number. This is listed at the end of the document. You can ask, but mostly I say, you know, the preferences are so many. I don't have a suggestion on where you should stay. We don't have any, uh, you know, trend, trend of where people stay because the locations change, right? Yeah, Kian. Uh, Ma'am, I wanted to make a very uh, genuine and a sincere request. If you yeah. can finish it at least an hour earlier, because I would like to catch the same flight back home. Because I would be coming on Friday evening since you're starting um, um, at 8 a.m. So I'll come on Friday evening. But I have another child, a young child at home. And, you know, I don't want to yeah. her to be by herself for two consecutive nights. So... I would like to catch a flight back on Saturday evening itself. Yeah. Is it sure. really possible for you to at least, you know, finish by five o'clock so that we can be oh, home? The the final, five o'clock, the finals will finish. Huh. Uh, it's pro then, uh, you know, uh, uh, succeeded by a quick conversation before we start the awards. But this is a conversation we can take off the call also. Uh, but I hear you. And that's why I want to be very clear that it's just a bad idea to do the booking the same day for any exceptions like yourself. Let's have a conversation off the call as well. Uh, 
okay ma'am yeah so stage yeah. three we've listed a few things that you should have this is okay uh, after i think you can draw, uh, we walk them through what the policies are the one thing that i will worry about is that i hope we really look forward to seeing you all in person uh, right uh, which is that if you just in any case have a situation that you know i can't make it in person you can't participate online for the finale right so you have to be in person kuch bhi hai reach back to the helpline number that we've given over there have a discussion we would love to support you uh, yeah avya avya's mom yeah ma'am uh, the mother currently just said that she's booked herself for friday evening the debate is on sunday right ha ah, i actually sorry you're right it is on sunday yeah because she said she's booked herself for friday evening that is why i'm just clarifying no i'm glad you pointed that out i'll speak to the um, uh, you know parent yeah okay. ma'am isn't isn't it on 12 the the brochure says 12 12 is a saturday yes no, it says 13th it says 13th please just look at the pdf that we circulated it's on 13th i'm so glad yes. uh, you pointed that out avya's mom because of the share our consideration a lot of people had come much earlier to us when we were doing the registrations so i think the first one communication went on 12 but it's been on 13th so far yeah okay so with that afreen i've already taken my 10 minutes please feel free to reach me or the team for anything that we can support you to be there we want to see you all we tend to see everyone who comes in uh, very exceptionally do people not land up yeah trida trida your hand is up okay af Uh, yeah good evening ma'am uh, ma'am i'm really sorry actually due to some network problems i joined a little late so has anything like important been told so if you can give for a the important bit so don't worry about it yeah neeti uh, after you can share the deck please take over uh neeti go ahead ma'am i just wanted to confirm could you just uh, clarify the timings like the approximate timings 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Okay, thank you, ma'am. All right. Sorry, uh, Kian's mom. If you're showing me something, we'll take this off the call. I'm quite clear. It is booked on 13th of October. That's not changing. Okay, Afreen, over to you. Uh, best of luck, folks. Once again, please go over the format briefings. Hi, everyone. Congratulations for making it to the offline Chandigarh. Chandigarh is such a happening city, and I'm really uh, proud of all of you all. Um. hoping that you all have a great time with team ideal as well offline um and i think regardless of whatever results happen on the day of finale i think just make sure that you all are learning well and you are prepared well as well um because you get a podium to speak everybody is going to be there you're going to have a, such a great time so um first of all congratulations um give a pat on your shoulder um and second of all all the best for the sem semi finals as well um so i'm just quickly going to go over the entire um uh, what what the event is going to look like and what's going to happen how should you prepare yourself and everything um and then if you have any questions you can always ask me so you know this csdl um and we're going to have um a quick um understanding in terms of how you're going to um, have your semi how you're going to have your finale so what can you what you what you have to do and what you can do so specifically for prepared turn coat motions the students are expected to carry previously prepared speeches so we have three formats as you all know and just to reiterate it these formats are going to happen um on the same day right so from the from morning 8 am to 7 pm because we're going to start from um we're going to start from from semi finals and then we're going to also have finals of all categories etc uh, which is why the day is really hectic um and we continue to um to calibrate the results and everything that continues to happen as well so we have three formats one of which only one format is prepared which is turn code um so what it means is when you get your topics you have to prepare your speech so you can get it printed you can get it written but we know we don't allow you to keep your laptop or any electronic device from which you would basically be reading or like referring to the speech essentially what we mean is that please do not carry um, electronic devices uh, for you to deliver speech but regardless of whether it is electronic device or printed speech um make sure that you're not like completely reading the speech you're you are memorizing the speech specifically because 
uh, we have had like we we're going to like call a lot of good judges and when the judges would see the semi finalists and the finalists are also reading out their speech in a public speech speaking event i think it gives a bad impression so for your own for your own reputation and for your own good performance i really appreciate i'd really appreciate if you all can simply by heart the speech i think that shows um really good manner but also confidence um which is really necessary for public speaking events per se the second thing to say here is that um, what you're going to do is, and when I say you're supposed to have printed speeches or like written speeches, I mean it specifically when people want to like practice their speeches. So which is why uh, for prepared motions as well, um, you uh, first prepare it. You can use any um, electron, you can use any um, search engines, uh, internet, anything for preparing your speech. Uh, but once your speech is prepared, make sure that when you're take, getting it um on the day of qualif on the day of semifinals, you're supposed to have it printed or written on a piece of paper. Um, so the second thing is for impromptu inspire, they are both um formats where we are going to release the topics on the spot. So a couple of things to note here. The first one is you will not have access to internet. The second one is you will also not have access to um electronic devices. Which means even if you want to write your speech, you're supposed to make it handwritten. So no ty typing as well. But the third thing to say is that um, what you can do, and this is the only thing that is allowed, is that previously research material is something that you can keep you with yourself. So if it is like printed printed material or printed sheets, you can actually have it uh, with you. Um, and then the second thing again is that regardless of whether your parents or guardians or coaches, teachers are with you on the day of qualify, on the day of semifinals, they're not allowed to help you during your speeches. So they cannot help you with, hey, these are the points you can use and all of that. So you, the only help they can give you is give you like a water bottle or snacks, uh, but they can't actually help you with preparing your speech, specifically for impromptu and um, spar. So please make sure of that. Um, lastly, in terms of um, observers policy and jury decision, um, in terms of observers policy first, um, observers are allowed in the room, which means when we're going to have parallel rooms of semifinals and finals, um, your parents, your guardians, your friends can actually watch the debate and, spe and speeches. But the catch is they're not supposed to give you any sort of assistance. But secondly, um, they're also not supposed to interrupt or they're just simply supposed to sit quietly there because we oftentimes see like a lot of commotion, a lot of um, like a noise being made, which basically disturbs the entire event. Jury's decision is going to be final. So we're going to have panels of three or five. Um, and the, the panel is going like the decision of the panel is at the end going to be um, like final, which means you cannot question the ju judge judgment, uh, but you can question um, so you can question them in terms of asking for constructive feedback, how to improve, etc. Um, yes, Niyati, what's your question? Uh, Ma'am, I wanted to ask uh, for SPAR, is it okay if we note down the points while the uh, opponent is speaking, like what they're speaking about, so we can uh, yeah, prepare yeah. the question? You can. Okay. Um, Nora? Yes, ma'am. So if we're supposedly in two formats, like I'm in impromptu and tone code, how did it exactly take place as all the finals are after lunch, right? Hmm. So no, all the finals aren't after lunch. Impromptu finals is going to be before lunch. Um. So what you can do is um, you can first give your impromptu and then your tone code, but I'll check the schedule and let you know personally, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Avya? Yeah, so I was just checking because this is the first time that Avya is coming for a physical debate. So mm. uh, while she is there at the venue from 8 a.m., uh, until her turn comes to go on the stage, uh, I can be with her and I can help her prepare, right? Yeah, you can, you can. <laughs> and also, is it possible for her to go on the stage and just understand the podium and be there and practice? Is that also a possibility? So yeah. I'm not sure. So before the round start and before everything, like before we formally begin, I don't think she'll have the time or like the space to actually check the podium and everything. But if there is like some break or something, she can definitely check. Yeah. So what we will do, I think it's a fair ask that you're asking. I'll just see if we can pick up the uh, pictures of the room and share it prior. But if you're coming back on time at 8 o'clock, I can tell you a lot of children will come in only to do registration. And that registration serves dual purpose of all of you just checking your names that have to go into the certificate. So just make sure that you reach early on time and then maybe you can walk around and have a get a sense of it, get a feel of it. The only other um, thing that you also see for smaller kids is also maybe a need for a quick stool um, so that they show up. But the rooms per se, as I understand in Manav Rachna, don't have a podium podium. Only the main hall for the finalists will have. 
um yeah that that's the bit that i wanted to add in yeah because avya is the seven so she's pretty short also yeah so. I, that's why i mentioned it that normally we tend to carry a stool for the kids or put a chair um or but the rooms the semi final rooms don't have a podium is my understanding but i will just make sure that you we'll try to get a picture for you so that you are you know just familiarize the but children are acclimatized to that we'll get thank the you thank you to lecterns as well no worries thank you so much navneet ma'am has joined us from trinity who is our partner for the debate really appreciate it ma'am it, it it is definitely a concern thank yeah. you yeah afreen Yeah, I think there's a question from a parent. Ah, uh, ma'am, I needed to understand. You mentioned to carry the previous debates, ah, uh, speeches. So, ah, uh, how would that help? Mm -hmm. I said for previously turn. search material. So, if you have, so if you have any, not turn code actually for impromptu or spar. So, a lot of people what they do is they keep a research material which is printed. So, it could be like quotes that they have used previously, quotes related to the theme, etc. Um, or like statistics related to the theme. Ah, uh, which they can probably use when they are speaking for their, the topic that we release on the spot. Sure. Thank you. Niyati. Yes, so I wanted to confirm that the same uh, topic for the speech will follow till the finals. As no, the... we're gonna release. No, so we're gonna release um separate topics for semi-finals and finals. Yeah. All right, thank. You. Okay. Um, thank moving. You. I want to mention, uh, Afreen. Uh, please know uh, if you come for earlier ideal debates that we tend to plan activities around for everyone. So there is yeah. a surprise session that we will also do for parents. uh but the good part is in the school premises it's very large so you'll enjoy seeing the facility so plan on not going out we'll cater to your meals uh we will cater for a quick snack to start the day for the parents of younger students but please it's not a good substitute to a breakfast so we're just following the international convention so for example oxford union just gives a dry bun a fruit and a little bit of a you know some snack to get started but kids are young so and you may they may have preferences so please feel free to cater to that lunch should be on the premises uh, you know provided by us so we'll give options on those sorry afin over to you yeah so the next one is about format so the format is exactly the same which means your speech time your structure is exactly going to be the same as qualifiers so for turn code and impromptu your speech time is going to be junior category 3 minutes middle category 4 minutes and senior category 6 minutes similarly for spar your structure is exactly the same for everyone the prep time is 2 minutes for junior category you have a constructive speech um and then you have 1 minute of crossfire for middle category you have a constructive speech 1 minute of crossfire and also a uh, 1 minute of reply speech for senior category you have constructive speech 2 minutes of crossfire and 2 minutes of reply speech um you will have your motions on the spot so that is something which is going to be the same as well which means for semi finals you'll have a different motion for finals you will have a different motion then about topic release and i think it's specifically for turn code so turn code topics are going to be released by the end of today which means you will receive it before the night today the second thing is that we are going to be releasing the topics for impromptu 7 minutes prior as as we did in the qualifiers for spa we're going to release it 2 minutes prior to the round as well um and then the last thing is that the topics are going to be still derived from the theme which is rise of indian influence preparing students for global work space so it's going to be the same um, like theme um the topics are going to be derived out of that theme I want to quickly note the equity guidelines. Um, we would like to remind remind you that we understand public speaking and debating is a very passionate activity. So when you are basically referring to other speakers and when you're engaging with other speakers, we want you to maintain a a, a minimum sort of decorum where you're respecting the other person, you're respecting the other person's ability, you're not making any remarks about their background, accent, gender, disability. Um, if anyone is found to be doing any of that. we will take strict actions against them so make sure that you are basically maintaining a healthy environment in debate specifically specifically mentioning spar because again spar is the only activity where you are engaging with other um debaters or in in the format per se the judging criteria remains the same natural manner and method so 10 10 10 spar is allowed to refer to the sheets but impromptu and turn code we make 
may we expect you to probably um, not refer to the sheet and probably rem remember this sheet um, and this basically means anyone who remembers the spe speech versus anyone who refers to the document versus anyone who is reading out the speech they're going to be differentially marked accordingly um next thing to say is that the qualify qualification and how it will happen. Um, so we are only having uh, finals for impromptu, which means we have only selected top three speakers, out of which one person gets gold, one person gets silver, and one person gets bronze. But specifically for turncoat and spar, we have different ways of qualification. I'll start from turncoat. We have qualified the top six speakers to the semifinals. In the sem based on your performance in the semifinals, we're going to see. Um, who moves to the finals. So the top three speakers move to the finals. And in the finals, the performance in the finals will basically determine whether you get gold, silver, or bronze. So that is basically going to be it. But also make sure, um, we wanted to remind you that the rounds from previous, um, like the scores from previous rounds do not carry forward, which means your performance in semifinals is not going to be um, any way affecting your performance in finals. I think the only time when we do that is when there is extreme tie ties between speakers, which is when we refer to the semifinal scores and the qualifier scores. But other than that, we do not ref like the scores from previous rounds do not carry forward. The second thing is for spars. For spar, we have qualified top four speakers in each category, which means we're going to have we are going to have two matches, um, which is basically um in terms of two parallel matches. So two speakers will be paired up together, uh, which makes two pairs. Whoever wins that pair, whoever wins that match goes to the finals. So the performance in the semifinals so is going to be deciding who goes to the finals. So whoever wins goes to the next um, next round. So it's a knockout round. Again, your scores do not carry forward. Um, and you are going to be basically decided like judged on your performance on the spot. Um, we're going to be releasing topics shortly, but yeah, I think there are multiple questions I would like to educate them now. Anya? Uh, Ma'am, I have two questions. So you mentioned topics for the semi-finals and the finals will be released today. So um, the topics for the both the event will be released today? Or yes, just... semi-finals and finals both will be released today. So and another question you mentioned, uh, you mentioned and might not be clear to me. So just for my understanding, I'm asking once again that you mentioned that the uh, finale will be in po podium, right? Manav Rajna School. And hmm. so semi-finals will be in separate rooms. Yes. Okay. And the fin uh, finale for all the categories will happen or in the podium? Um, Anjali ma'am, could you clarify that? Yeah. I mean, broadly, I think you are accurate about uh, repeating what I just mentioned, but we're just tying the loose ends on that one. Uh, what we will try to do to arrest time because we are doing multiple formats, we are running the semi-finals simultaneously in uh, smaller rooms, right? So we're just working towards making sure that the impromptu finals are happening in the main hall, but We'll update you closer then, right? Okay, ma'am. Thank you so much. Trida? Ma'am, I wanted to ask that, uh, like, the results will be announced on that day itself? Or... So, for semi-finals, right. we're going to re release the results post-lunch. So, you would know whether you're making it to the finals. Um, and then the finals results will be announced um, the same day, uh, which is, as Anjali ma'am said, it, it is 6 o'clock. Six o'clock. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Niyanti? Ma'am, I just wanted to ask, can we, like, make up statistics on the spot for spar and impromptu? As in make up in the sense you would lie about it? No. No, like, it, it, will, be believe, it will be fake, but not that unbelievable. No, I mean, so the idea is that you're also not expected to quote statistics, right? So, yeah. um, if you're quoting statistics, which an average reasonable voter would not know, it won't make any sense to the judge as well. Okay. Yeah. So rather than saying 60% of people, you can just say most people. Um, so you don't have to actually rely on statistics. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Naira? Okay. Are there any more questions? Okay, one thing that I want to uh, like mention. Um, yes, Avia, before that. Okay, yeah, so one thing that I wanted to mention is even though I'm not coming, I would um, want you all to actually like follow our dress code. It is ethnic, semi-formals or formals. I think it'll be really cool. Um, so specifically because our theme is um, 
our theme is about India, and I think it will be really great. Specifically, also because it's festival season. I'm so amazed that really... you haven't given characters from, uh, you know, <laughs> Ramayan this time. Normally, you're very creative with that, but we kept it to traditional. Yeah. Uh, because we didn't have dra- uh, dramatic adaptation this time, but yeah. it'd be lovely to see you in traditional. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, Abhya. Ma'am, I just wanted to check so on the day of the qualifier. Avya had to leave soon after her debate on the for the third round because she had a chess tournament. So is it? And she has scored the lowest in the third compared. Like the first two rounds were pretty high compared to the forum, third. You can always mail us. We can just give you the feedback for the third round. Correct. Just okay, perfect. Hello at the rate ogly Okay, perfect. Thanks. Okay. Uh, anybody else? Any questions? We listed the number. Uh, yeah, Joyna. Okay, so you mentioned some documents to be brought for the, uh, you know, in the physical form for the in Manav Rachna. Could you please clarify those documents? There were some like Aadhaar cards or identity proof, something like that. That's more uh, for your own travel. Uh, we've had instances where we had to immediately come and do some rescue mission because COVID is on, off, uh, you know, travel, student tickets were booked, but student ID was not carried. Just I think it's always safe to time. have like an identity proof yeah. is what we're trying to say. Correct, please, you know. So, oh, okay. yeah. And also, uh, since the impromptu finals will be before lunch, is it possible that the participants can maybe leave the premises and then come back before the results are announced? No. It will actually uh, move very fast. We want you to be on the premises and we plan the day accordingly. Um, okay. So no leaving the premises once you are there. Uh, there was something else that struck me. Yes. So we will circulate a security form to check the availability of who's coming, who's accompanying. Uh, and uh, please fill it up when I give you a deadline. And on, incidentally, I think Devika ma'am has given you a deadline of around 6 p.m. today. I hope all of you have responded to her because the invites to the schools have to go, right? So wherever possible, especially the local schools, we would love it if your educators join us uh, because often, uh, you know, educators do travel to attend uh, along with the students. So feel free to share that with us so that formally we can communicate that. Uh, the other thing is, like I said, that we will circulate a security form just to know who's coming and, you know, to cater to that. So just that's the other thing that you will see on the group. And we'll keep putting timelines around it. I would appreciate no reminders. Right? Um, yeah, Anya? Anya, Nora, hands up. Ma'am, can you hear me? Yeah. No. So, ma'am, in semi-finals, will there be three rounds? Like... Uh the previous one or there will be one round in turn court ma'am afreen yeah so semi finals one round and then if you make it if you are in the top 3 you make it to the final then another one round yes it is one so, one round so the child has to prepare for two speeches right correct yes and ma'am uh, you just quote uh, mentioned that uh, statistics should not be mentioned so this is so no so do not be confused um in impromptu and sparse it is so since the topic is released on the spot we don't expect you to know statistics but in turn code we specifically are marking you for statistics and research okay so we can mention yeah thank you so much no issues yes varis Mama, I just wanted to ask for turn court. Is it mandatory to carry only palm cards or we can keep the whole speech with us for reference? Like if we are not reading from it, but in case we forget a point, we can refer yeah, to it. You can keep your speech in case if you forgot. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, Trida? Uh, so like I, uh, like first of all, I will send all my details after this like session is up as I was out somewhere. And second of all, like, I just wanted to be once again clear that now this event is happening in Manav Rajna Mohali, right? As before, I think it was written higher, or uh, I don't know, because my parents had a little query about it. So, Manav Rajna, right? Okay, thank you. Ishan? Mom, the children who are not qualified uh, for the finals can leave the, can leave the school when the semifinals are done. 
no because you will also have so we also have really amazing like gifts and um, like awards for semi finalists so i wouldn't basically say that you should leave but you should also witness the finals because you would know what you missed in your speech okay thank you all right thank you so much everyone for joining in uh, in case if you have if you still have any doubts you can always um reach out to us um till then bye bye Okay, Ma'am, just ask? one Come sec. Uh, the food would be provided there, uh, or we have the option to purchase because the, you said we won't be leaving the premises. Food will be provided uh, for the lunch and breakfast. A uh, few things for the debaters have been uh, provisioned for. Uh, but if you have any specific uh, requirement request, especially on allergy and stuff, we'll just capture it on the form as well. um with younger children like i was saying right if you want to cater to fruits fresh cut fruits you know anything specific then please do cater to that that will be very helpful sure thank you ma'am okay uh yeah tripti uh hi uh can you please just briefly uh, tell me uh, when is this uh, semi final and i know it is in ramanav rashna school mohali but when is it and what are the timings i just missed the initial part no worries we just circulated Thanks. two documents on the group uh which is uh, stating the time as well as the day uh which is 13th of october 8 am to 7 pm right uh you can go over the document as well we just made sure that that is also circulated we'll just put the recording out as well uh thank you join. Forty seven, you guys. So, parent, uh, do parents need to accompany the kids at all the times because mine will not be available for the entire eleven hour timeline. No, no, you have to. So, uh, and thankfully here it's a school; it's not an IIT Delhi. I would have mandated it in in a college premises. Now, uh, for a senior category student, if they are in much higher grades, then you can probably leave them and go because thankfully we have a school. but i expect the guardian to be there because nadi nobody from the organizing committee is going to look into or have the bandwidth to look after students and where they are right? Uh, right so you just have to keep that in mind that we can't take that burden right now yeah naira uh, ma'am when will the motions be released for turn court category uh i think afreen ma'am sort of talked about it she is looking at releasing it between today or tomorrow morning she'll just put that message out in the group it's on the deck Okay thank you ma'am all right everyone thank you so much uh see you soon yeah all right thank you thank you ma'am which you, number ma can i contact you on it's bye. there on the <laughs> bye it's where on, on the group na aap are you on that group the whatsapp group that is being created yes ma'am aap ek bari bata do please hai aapko ispe na chat aap likh liyo 88104 yes ma'am Um, six five seven nine nine. Can I give you a call? That's what I get. Ah, uh, yeah, you can. I'll give you a call right now. Yeah, you can. I mean, Thank I might not be on the number, but uh, just raise the concern there, just in case they don't reach. Just leave a message and we'll come back. Yeah, Ishan. Ma'am, could you just please send all the important points and on the chat today? Yes, absolutely, Ishan. Thank you so much for joining. Thank you, Navneet. Navneet, I've just sent okay. some. Bye, Ishan. Take care. Ah, uh, Navneet. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let me just stop recording.